Um, my students knew uh, before you folks came, they, I tell them in advance, this is what the quarter will be like, this is your starting product and your finished product will be a brochure. So they knew beforehand exactly what was expected of them. Those of them that were not able to present, that's, I'm sorry, I'm very cut and dry. Uh, you're very, if you're, it's there, it's there. If it's not, you're not getting the grade. Um, so I know that they do try hard, um, but my expectations are very high for my students, especially when it comes to the animals. Um, we have a lot of tours, so I do have to make sure that everything looks presentable, doesn't smell anything, so everybody knows that they have to take a lot of pride in all their work. Even though I was sitting during presentations, I, I do ask a question here or there. I do help them when they need help. Um, I very I like to make sure that they feel comfortable. Um, so I will help them, guide them. I walk around when they're doing chores, make sure everybody's okay. And they're able to tell me, oh, miss, I did this, 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 just so we're all on the same page. So there's a good communication between all me and my students. Uh, planning, not much. This is a usual day, so the only thing I had to do was make sure that presentations were first. That way they had, usually it takes my students about 30 to 40 minutes to do chores because there's a wide range of chores that need to get done. So as long as I plan accordingly and I know about how long they need for presentations, then the chores will get done, which is kind of a big chunk of their grade. Classroom management, during the presentations, there was, I had to calm, the clapping were getting too loud and um, some people were not paying attention. So I just do little, give them a little look and they understand. Um, that's all from the beginning of school year. It's all about respect. I tell them, all the, I tell them that all the time. Um, I go around, I make sure, I'm, very, I'm always trying to be seen. So everybody knows that I'm not just working with the mule. I'm still helping with the fish pond. I'm still making sure guinea pigs are getting done. So. My students understand that, yes, there's a lot of animals, and since working with the mule, it does take up a lot of my time because that is a big safety factor because the animal is out. I do make sure that, I, I, you see, I do have two other people, that somebody is always there for safety to make sure everybody's okay. Students were engaged. They were, I, at the end of the period, I collected notes from everybody. Everybody was completed. There were questions being asked. Um, there was praise, all the chores were completed by the end of the period, and Bingo got to go out and play. Uh, the students were actually able to actually present what they've learned throughout the quarter. So yeah, the disease part was just a small section of it, but they were able to relate it to, oh yeah, our animal had this problem. What happened? Our animal actually had that, we've seen it. So at least they were able to make a connection between the different presentations. Chores, that's a daily practice. I tell them before they sign up for my class, if you, yes, animals are cute and cuddly, but they do do their business and they need to be cleaned weekly. So that is just the, and you'll notice that the students do the exact same chores because they have a connection with the animals and they enjoy that chore. So um, the students will take initiative. It's kind of like their animal, that they take care of that certain animal. So that's how I kind of run it. The mule, pretty much, we're just trying to desensitize him. We're trying to make sure that he's safe around people. Um, our goal is to take him out for the football game. So that's why we're out there with pom-poms, or we're jumping, screaming, clapping, just so he gets used to all that. We're pounding the thing for as if it was a drum or band, just so we know how he's going to be. And the students do well. Those two students work with him every day. I would like to spend more time on maybe presentation skills. Um, the main thing, since this is the first presentation of the year, I just wanted them to be able to come in front of the class and present something. Um, next quarter when they do their business plan, we'll be able to actually do a PowerPoint and actually talk with the PowerPoint with a partner. So we'll see how that goes. Just keep developing those skills.